What is going on guys? My name is Everletcher and today I am back with another Pixel Gun 3D video. So yes, I'm not quitting. I told y'all that. I'm still going to do reviews and weapon reviews and update reviews and stuff on the game. But um, other than that, that's probably going to be about it. I'm going to try to balance out all my videos between Pixel Gun and Modern Combat 5. So let's go ahead and get right into this new update review. So right here in the Trader's Van, we have the Semi-Auto Shotgun, the Propitiator. I cannot say that. The Stinger 3000, the Airstrike Laptop, these all look so cool. The Heavy Sniper Rifle, the Police Zapper, the Pixel Cola Refresher, and the one I already bought right here, the Deadly Digital System. So, um, this one is glitched, and if you buy it right now, you're only going to get 11 efficiency. Um, it's supposed to be, I think, 59. I'll show you guys that in a second. So if we come into the armory, we'll be able to see exactly how these weapons fire. So right here, we have the semi-auto shotgun. I'm just going to shoot it right here. There you guys go. It's just three shots, and uh, three or four shots, and then that's it. And then in the backup section, we have the pro propitiator. Propitiate. Propiti. I can't. <laughs> I, I don't know. But here we go right there. It's just kind of like a normal pistol. I mean, there's nothing special to it. It just looks really cool. And then in the melee section, I do not think there's anything. No, there's not. And then, But in the special section, we have a deadly digital, digital system, which has... It should be a melee. I honestly think that 100% because it has no ammo. And it's pretty much a storm hammer. I've already tried it. It's completely OP. I already recorded this once, but I kind of accidentally deleted it. Um, And then I believe we have the other things somewhere no maybe not so right here we have the heavy sniper rifle and right there it says efficiency 59 but if you click on it it's only efficiency 11 so do not buy it right now it's very cheap though and it looks really cool um yes it is taken out of fortnite but they did redesign it a little bit so that's good um so right now they're proving lots of the stuff that i said yesterday in the video wrong but i don't really have a but so right here the heavy sections are probably the most overpowered this update we have the Stinger 3000, which has manual guidance, area damage, and 4 times zoom. There it goes right there. It reminds me of a lot of the Smart Bullet Bazooka, but um, not as overpowered, probably, hopefully. And then right here, we have the Pixel Color Refresher, which is very, very fast-firing weapon. And I already see it now. This is going to be nerfed very, very soon because it's going to be very OP. And then right here, we have the Airstrike Laptop. And there we go. It's just a charge shot, manual guidance, area damage, sort of like the other one that they have. I forget the name of it. It's a backup weapon. And then right here, we have the Police Zapper, which honestly, I believe should... I don't even know what I believe for this, but um, it slows the target down. It's pretty much just a taser, uh, one of the hand tasers, you know. But the computer thing is really similar to the Orbital Pistol. Just um, apparently, they added manual guidance. I do not understand how they could do that. But um, that's what it reminds me of right there. But that's really it for this update. I mean, there's just a bunch of new weapons. They're, they did really good with the some of the prices. Some of them are a bit pricey over here in the trader's van. Um, such as... Okay, maybe not. I guess I was wrong. But once the sale goes away, yes. Like, 970 for the airstrike laptop. I mean, yeah, at least it's coins. But it's that's a lot of coins for one weapon. And then right over here, 870. That's still overpriced for one weapon. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for all the support on the last video. I really hope you guys did enjoy this review. If you guys did, make sure you leave a like, comment down below what you would like to see come into Pixel in 3D, and comment down below which one of these weapons is your favorite weapon in this new update. I will have a re well, gameplay on this new weapon right over here very, very soon, so be looking forward to that. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, turn on the bell notifications, and I will see you all in the next video. Let me, let me, let me